Welcome FNews 57 here. I'm on my Xbox Series X today playing some uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 campaign and I will be showing you how to get the iCall Shotgun 15 Gamer Score achievement for driving a vehicle with a sentry gun on the back and having it kill five enemies. So obviously there's going to be a few different missions you can do this on. Uh, the first spot that I found to do it is on the second mission, the open combat mission Precious Cargo. So if this is your first time playing through the mission, it will be a little bit different and a little bit harder but uh, you can do this on any difficulty or you can simply replay the mission after completing it from the starting point uh, where you go to the first container to get your parachute you're gonna want to kind of sneak past the majority of the enemies leaving them alive so we can come back to them later making your way to the north northeast to go ahead and get on this ship uh, if you have the ascender you can go ahead and come right up this rope otherwise you can pick up an ascender next to the crane um, and the ship kind of like uh, right there basically uh, wait for that vehicle to park and then we are going to just go as fast as we can to get the sentry gun uh, so if you have the parachute, which you should have, you can make a quick landing onto the ship. And you can kill the enemies or you can leave the enemies. It doesn't really matter. There's some extra armor plates. There's a sentry gun right here. And now what we want to do is we want to make our way to this truck. And then pretty much make like the achievement says drop the sentry gun on top of the truck and just go ahead and casually drive this around until it's had the opportunity to kill five enemies you should be able to get this achievement within a matter of maybe a couple of minutes so just kind of keep track of how many enemies the sentry gun has killed uh, make sure you don't actually run them over and overall, it is pretty darn easy to get this achievement. You should have your achievement pop up just like that with the achievement unlock in game. If for whatever reason the achievement pop up doesn't show up right away, then you can simply go to the official club, and this is what I recommend to everyone, to double check that the achievement has actually unlocked. Uh, now, there are other missions you can do this on, but this is the first opportunity I found to do it. I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you have any questions, comments, anything like that, feel free to ask, and I'll do my absolute best to help you guys out. Until next time, stay frosty.